Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Cyberpunk 2077. Now, off screen, I actually did do a little thing, a few little things. I ran around to the outside of my apartment building, just the uh, general sweep of this floor, as well as went down to the parking lot. Uh, collected a few items, not a whole lot, just a few things here and there, and basically just tested some things out. So, pretty cool. So let's go. To, let's actually show off our character real quick. So yeah. Oh, on, let's... Yeah. Inventory. This is easier. These are the only outfits I have that I actually kind of like, so... Yeah. Oop. Rotate. There's my shotgun. There it is. So yeah, I kind of like how it looks. Uh, I'm not a big fan of the pink, because I'm not a big fan of the color pink itself. But I do like the uh, bomber jacket look. Um, I do enjoy this cotton long sleeve, though. Which, apparently, I rolled the sleeves when I put on the, put on the jacket. Um, I was also able to level up last time, so I turned in those points. This uh, is quite an in-depth leveling up system. So basically we have our uh, core five abilities. You can level them up with attribute points. So I was able to level up my intelligence a bit so we can hack a little bit more. Then each tree has their own... Um, well, each uh, area has their own tree that's associated with the abilities. For example, Breach Protocol. Here we can see the abilities we learn. Uh, over here we can get quick hacking, the abilities associated to that. Um, I actually upgraded, I think, athletics. Yeah. To get pack mule, increase my carry weight. I'm going to level up uh, regeneration next, which gives me a HP regen during uh, combat. Then I'll move on to some of the other abilities. Because those are the core ones I want right now. But it's kind of cool. Oop, that's ceiling. I also love this. It's just, hey, I, I, I'm feeling a little peckish. Uh, let's see here, give me a candy bar or something. Which is kind of cool. Or a burrito. Then we have our shower. Nice view. You see, in here, my hair looks the, the, the white, which I like. But when I was making the character, there was none. And here we have our emails, our phone, for our uh, computer, our closet, our storage, our little living room, and our bed. It's actually a really nice bed. Oh, hello. Hmm. Okay. Well, let's go to sleep. Uh, don't even sleep properly. Sleep, sleep like a slob. That's okay. Act one. Oh, where's my coat? I have my coat on. I think I fixed that. Also got this coat. Straight up, uh, just, this is just straight up a custom, uh, or a updated version of uh, the Martin McFly Jack from Back to the Future, and I love it. All right, put that back on. There we go. <sighs> Jackie, what's up? Whoa, V. Get your beauty sleep. <laughs> no matter. Time you got up. I think I might have caught something. When I jacked into that corpo's biomon. I know a neurovirus or I need to see Vic. Let him tell me what's got my head reeling and my stomach churning. Okay, let me take you. I brought you a ride. Yeah, throw on some threads, meet me downstairs. Okay. Um also quick heads up. Um if you link uh in the main menu, you link your uh, CD Projekt account with your console account, you can get a uh, Witcher jacket. It's not a jacket from the Witcher, it's literally just a, uh, b a jacket put on with the Witcher logo on the back, which is kind of cool. Alright. Oh, That's the burrito. Also, over here, yeah, here it is. 
Hi. Hey V, Regina Jones here. If you're looking for work in Watson, give me a call. How did you find me? How'd you even know my name? I know where to gather my intel. Could even call me a collector. Later, V. Okay, sure, fine. Uh, first get rid of that map marker I have. I was trying to go sell some stuff, but I couldn't do it during the during that. All right, turn that off. Okay. Uh, sell some junk. What don't I need? All right. So I don't like this hat. Don't like this bomber vest. I'm gonna keep the jacket. Not a big fan of keeping that. Wait. Frayed scav combat shirt. I'm gonna keep that because I don't remember that. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. Don't need them shorts. Don't need this. And don't need that. <laughs> we got a good amount of cash. Nice. Budka. I'm gonna keep that. Okay, these things actually do have effects too. Okay, I keep gotta keep an eye on those. Barito. Don't need that. Cactus juice. Wait, please tell me. Oh, I was hoping to say it's the quenchiest. That been so great. Um, let's see. Do, 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 do. Don't need the whiskey. Next, it seems like a uh, a vodka drinker, in my opinion. Soy paste. Ugh. Yeah, get rid of that. Bounce back. Okay. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Vanta Joku. Winter? Something winter. I know Joku. Um, <laughs> I know Joku basically means like snow or cold. But I don't know Vanta. Interesting. We'll keep that. What is this menu? Pack of smokes, perfume. Alright, until I know exactly how the craft system in this game works, I'm gonna keep all that other side stuff. Ma'am. Okay, guys. We got a call. We're here to help. We know you're in there. Can I talk to you guys? No. All right, you have fun with that. Got another dry, sun-filled week coming your way, Night City. Wait, hold on. Soak in that sun while you can. Bam, bam, bam. Stairs? Yeah. Was that Jackie's room? Oh, he's over there. Okay. Yeah, no. What's up? Piece of shit. Come on. I'm not a big fan of the uh sitting on ledges trope. The worst thing is about this place. No. No fucking smell. Oh. Looks so good. Hi, right, man. Yes, I call you. Good day that. to you. What's this? Hey, yo, B. How about a round or two? What do huh? You Who's talking to me? Oh, damn. Hola. Hola, como estas? That's as far as my Spanish goes. How you like my new punching bag? Just gave me a next gen ass whooping. <laughs> Coach Fred? I'm curious to see how he handles the likes of me. <laughs> so, how about it? Sure, why not? Light on your feet. Keep that head moving. <laughs> Do it. Ah. 
Nice. You got one hell of a punch there, Jim. Ever thought of monetizing it? I can arrange a fight or two. What do you say? What have you got for sale? Only top shelf gear. Let's see what you got. Ooh, okay, okay. Machete, nice. Oh, how much? Street cred. Uh, don't, can, can, can I get it? Oh, I need more street cred. Oh, I want a katana. Ah, oh, I get a katana. Yes, katana. Sell junk. Yeah, sure. Okay, so uh, there's a dedicated sell junk button, which means that that stuff's not important. Good to know. Got me a katana. Kunai. Oh, those are mods. Okay. Cold shoulder. What does that say? Scourge. Why not? Interesting, interesting. You mentioned something about fighting? Hmm. I've seen you landing blows in the ring. You've got sharp instinct, good edge. You can go far, especially if you get chipped. These fights, let's just say they aren't legal. But very lucrative. Lucrative really? for who? You or me? Both of us. I get a small percentage of the total winnings, you know, as your agent. You get the rest. Hmm. Sounds fair. Sounds fair. It's like I said. Good instinct. Fights happen in different parts of the city. You choose where you want to go. Put down your eddies and start swinging. You win. You take home the pot. Manage to drop every last one of them. You get a chance to fight the grand finale. That all clear? Crystal. Good. Oh, except you won't be setting foot outside or what? Not yet. You can start in Kaboom. I believe in you, V. Time to show this city what you're made of. Okay. I'll keep that in mind. First things first, I'm gonna equip that katana. Alright. Put the shotgun here for that. Alright. Alright. Wait. Hey, hold on. Coach Freed. All right, I'll keep that. I'll keep that in uh, mind later on. Uh, let's get the quest going. I'm not going to do every quest on screen, mind. Um, I will do a lot of them, but not all of them. Where is my quest lock? Here we go. All right, Jack, here we have, buddy. Hey, he's down in the garage, that's right. Hey, what's up? Let's have a look. Hmm. Don't want to see a lot. I see a lot, it's not a lot, you know? Alright. I want to find a freaking clothing store first. The administrators of implant authorization are now the manufacturers, guided by the standards they themselves. Yeah. Yes, I am a weep. I don't care. Cut your gun from Wilson. Wait, what? Hold on a sec. It's going to be a long elevator ride back up. From all of us at WNS News, we wish you a safe and fun Matsuri. 
enjoy yourselves, Night City. Sigma is not, is not only for the rich. <laughs> Myth or reality. Stay tuned. Uh, new job, get an upgrade. Hmm. Foreign bo body. Or is it boy? Foreign boy! Hello, Night City. Hi. I'm Jillian Jordan with N54 News. And this is your weapon. Magic paper. The NCPD has urged caution when using data. Alright, you said you got. You have a gun for me? Alright, let's see what you got. What I like to hear. Oh, it's this one. All right. Let's take a look at this gun and see how it compares to my current one. It's better. I like it. Alright. Okay. Is there a... No. <laughs> Honestly, it shouldn't surprise me that there's a gun store called the Second Amendment. <laughs> I'm more surprised it's not an actual chain. Okay. Alright, there we go. So, I mentioned this uh, when I first started this Let's Play, that I have a passion for cyberpunk. Uh, this mostly has to do with um, uh, I lead a battle angel. It was what introduced me into the concepts of uh, cybernetic storytelling like this. And sadly, a lot of the battle angel games I've seen suck. So I'm looking forward to this. Nagami. So, we can hmm. talk about yesterday. It's all in the report. Oh, I read it. Except there's no mention of me telling you to delta the fuck out of there. Alright, so they're cops. Hey. Yeah. No big Oh. Uh, see, MC the MCCPD will pay you to help fight crime. Gig fixers will contact you with uh, when you approach the gig's location. Fixers, intermediaries will inform you about local gig. Okay, cool. Hey, man, we got soda and uh, them fries and burgers. Cool. Hey, Jackie! How's Missy doing? Mm. Woman of the hour. Jeez. It took you long enough. Looked up an appetite just waiting. That's it. Sit down. Let me finish this. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. Sounds good. You mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right, or just had a brain fart? Probably both, because... You usually forget shit, but it just so happens, I think I might have bagged us a sweet-ass J-O-B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but just that he's fronted by a little-known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat-ass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold-plated coup. How did you manage to pull this? Trade in your spleen or something? As far as I know, we're not the type to get fingered by Dex. You me? Oh, but t -Buck, she's the one that hooked us up. Got us talking. Knew it was a done deal the moment he laid eyes on me. Cause come on, ain't nobody who can resist this. Am I right? <laughs> sure, Jack. Whatever you say. Dexter Deshaun. What's the latest spec on him? No, you got info to spill. He'd been off the grid for about two years. Word on the street was, took a little vacay. 
two years. That's exile, not a vacation. How was he up to? Uh, guessing he shoved pizzas in his mouth while jerking off the hardcore virtues. The important thing is he's back. With a fresh group, he found us. So what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Well, our savior wants to tell you everything himself. Face to face. No pressure, but... No deal's riding on you now, chica. Why do I gotta go? You and T-Bug draw straws without me? T-Bug and Dex go way back, and my face is yesterday's news. All Dex says he needs to check you. Talk to you. Look, V, it's his job, his rules. I can't blame him for taking a personal approach. And it ain't as bad as you think, okay? Trust me. Guess I got no choice, then. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or the Caco, but Dex is in a league of his own. Don't get me started on fixers. They catch a client, find the cheapest gonk to do the job, then drop their corpse at a landfill. Shit. Hit the nail on the head, V. Gracias. Oh, yeah, no. Brought your wheels. Gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our uh, dust up with the scabs. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Some top notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory new ride. So I'm uh I'm glitching. Also that Nikomon looks so good. Uh look at that duck. look at it. Not bad. Clean her up nice. First stop. Ripper duck. A chica. Easy on the gas, eh? I just ate. Uh, how do I go? I was supposed to stop by Vic's there anyhow. We go. I got a date. Me and Miss D. You don't say. She's so sweet. Really gets me, you know. Oh. Alright. Oh, jeez. Still gotta get that fixed. Oh, what's the button the radio? R1. Um. Oh, here we are. Let's see here. No station. Oh, I missed a, missed a turn. Definitely has more traction than my, uh, dust butt, my old dust bucket from the other one. From out, from out in the sticks. I'm assuming the park on the X. Yep. Yeah, this is it. Come on, V. Find me once Vic's done dusting your circuits. We'll hash out what Dex has cooked up for us. All right, so I can find valuable caches, like you say. I'll keep an eye for that. Okay. Do you truly believe that those who have sold you to the What's up? Hey V. Misty! Dr. Vector will see you now. I'll sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little kitchen up to do. Okay. You look pleased. Cause I am. <laughs> Always. Make for easier than that. Huh. <laughs> I don't have a bad feeling about this, but let's see where this goes. Uh, let's see here. The common practice cyborg installation is still a dangerous and invasive procedure which can be performed by qualified specialists, Ripper Docs. There are several Ripper Docs operating throughout Night City who offer a variety of different cyberware upgrades. Select your desired upgrade 
and enjoy your new abilities. All right. Hey, Vic. Vicky, spry as ever, you old ripper. Good to see you. Good to see you too, V. Oh, wow. What do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neuro socket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Oh, kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Met a new fixer. Gave me a job. Name's Dexter Deshawn. Known quantity from the afterlife. No denying you're moving up. But Something you're not telling me, Vic? Keep your guard up, that's all. I've heard some things about Dex. He's not as chill as he makes himself out to be. Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean. Hit in the major leagues. Need tech that can perform. The Dexter Deshawn? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later, with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time, you hear? Chair, please. Sit down and relax. Kuroshi Optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Now jack in. Kuroshi, whoa! Vic, nothing tops that on the market. Hmm. Sounds like it could come in handy, then. I gave you my word I'd pay you back, but this... might be too rich for my blood. We'll work something out. Right now, I'm just out to make sure you get back in one piece. Eddie's in hand. You peruse and choose while I scan. See what's going on inside. <laughs> All right, let's see here. Cybertech, uh, cybernetic implants are mechanical upgrade or uh, replacements for the organic parts of your body. They can give you superhuman-like abilities, which can improve your combat capability and help you survive in hazardous conditions. Although a common practice in 2077, the inst uh, installation of cyberware is still an invasive. Yeah. Okay. So, ocular or hand, you say? Let's see what we got. Enhances my vision. Okay. Where'd I get a hand upgrade? Zoom in so I can read that better. Increases the chance of ricochet shots with power weapons. Directly links to use this optical implant to the weapon system, offering real time data tracking. Hmm. Subway you acquire in the world can be installed or sold at a Rip Doctor. Oh, so this is what I got. Okay, that makes sense. Enhances my vision. Alright. So I just stole some dude's hand. That's great. Uh, there is a trophy I know of that involves putting something in all of these things. So I'm looking for this. I'm looking for a better OS, though. That's, that's kind of... Uh, Need four? Two RAM? Ugh. Alright. These things are pricey as fuck, too. Don't think I can buy any of them. I can't get the crafting stuff for some of them. What's this? I'll have a thousand. Oof. Mark one, like I said. 
Decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. Lay that major league arm of yours right here. So, what's new in the life of Victor Vector? <sighs> yeah, if I'm being honest, not much. And that's fine with me. I used to live in a world where all that mattered was who's who, what's what, and how's why. And what happened? One day, I just dropped it and never looked back. I'll never be a legend in this town, but been sleeping nights ever since. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Feel anything? Play-by-play, -play, though? <laughs> really, Doc? Makes you sound like a dentist, always going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky Gannick hand. Could slip. Lights out for a minute, all right? Ugh. I like Victor, though. He's pretty cool.